Good evening, friend knows It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory More, Curse of the Dead Gods tonight. Uh, last time, we nearly made it all the way through, like, the the topmost um, bit of the temple here. Uh, we got very, 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 very close. Uh, we were in what was presumably the final phase of the final boss fight, um, but then we kind of fell apart. Uh, which is unfortunate, but hey, that that's how it goes sometimes. Uh, so let's see, what do we got? We got 180 skulls. I don't think we can really do much with that, except unlock a bunch of shit that we don't need. Or that we're never gonna use. Um, hmm, except for this one. What, which is the one I was considering giving up? This one, right? The corruption thingamading? Uh, because I do kind of like, you know, good play giving you damage boosts, good play giving you damage boosts, etc. So why don't we, uh... Plug this one in here. I'm gonna take out this one, even though it's pretty nice. We're gonna put that one in. Yeah. All right. We'll we'll see how that goes. Like having the the corruption limit increased from 100 to 120 is pretty good. But um, let's play a little bit more dangerously this time. Why not? Okay. So what do we got? We got claws, a whip, and a spear. Ooh, fire claws. I do like fire claws. Uh, the barbed whip is pretty good too, since it weakens. Uh, but we don't have a sword, so that's unfortunate. But, we do have a 30% damage boost against burning enemies with the spear. That's uh, already a good synergy. What else we got here? Normal ass sword, a pistola that restores health on kills, and a poison spear. And then a ham normal ass hammer, pretty much. A lightning whip, and a barbed javelin. No, we're gonna go with the uh, fire claw whip spear. And play one of the event things that are going on. Hopefully it's... God, why do we have two? We've got two of the the Cursed Archer ones. And what's this? Flee the light, blah, 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 blah. Register the entire thing. Well, whatever. Okay, so, like... Man, I don't really like the Cursed Archer events. Like, I, I can enjoy the Cursed Bow or whatever. That's fine. The fact that we get these so often is kind of silly. But anyways, let's do this one. Let's do the other non-Cursed Archer one. See what we're dealing with here. Let's look forward a little bit. We got one, only one vault. Only one vault, that's silly. But that's alright. Uh, let's start here and hope we get enough money just kind of right before we get to the, the attribute thing. Well, let's see. What do we have? We have fire claws, we've got a barbed whip, and we've got a normal spear that has uh, a good synergy with fire, right? That's the whole deal. And the, the whip is a really solid secondary. I really do like it. 20% uh, base damage for swords. We don't have it, but we don't have a sword, but we'll take it anyways. We might trade up for a sword at some point. Oh, yep. <laughs> I knew that fucker was going to try something. Oh, oh, nice. Okay, got out, got out of that one pretty good. Hey, Omega Weapon, how you doing? Let's see. We, can we still light shit up with our dark torch? We can't. Oh, that's kind of stupid. Oh man, can't set that stuff off with our little torch of darkness. That's. I don't know how to feel about it. Actually, I do know how to feel about it. I think it's silly. Yeah, there you go. Get hit by the trap, idiot. <laughs> Get hit, idiot. Because it means we can't do... Well, we can't do anything about this anyways, I guess, right? Because we're... Because we don't have the weaponry to do anything about it. But if we could light it up... Actually, wait. There. That's right. I forgot we have a... Literally claws that are on fire. <laughs> so we can just light it up normally. Good job. Good job, good job. 20% uh, base damage for spears. Well, we've got that. Oh. So we can use that one at the very least. At the very least, we can use that one. Let's see. We're gonna have a relic purchase here, but we're not gonna it's not gonna be worth anything. Although we could just go for blood offering. Oh man. That's fifteen percent damage. Oh, but that's seventy. That would give us a, a curse pretty much immediately. But it might be worth it. That's that's eight percent damage boost and then doubling any healing effects we get later on. 
that is exceedingly tempting. You know what? Fuck it. Let's go. Fuck it. This is kind of a throwaway run anyways. So let's just go for it. Let's just go for it. We'll take on whatever meaningless ass curse this is going to be. And we'll just deal. We'll just fucking deal. Alright, what do we got? La -da 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 -da. One of your relic slots is locked. Okay, that kind of sucks. This one kind of sucks, because I do like my relic slots, but... Whatever. We'll deal. We'll deal. It's fine. We'll deal. Got me. Caught me looking on that one. Shit bag. Alright, what do we got there? Increased weakened effects duration. That's actually kind of useful now. Since we do have a a guaranteed weakness thing with our charge secondary, right? I mean that last longer is gonna be super good. Actually, wait, is this actually anything? I feel like that should be something. It's glowing blue. How dare they try to throw me off. There. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Wait, what's that? Why did that just go out? Oh, does our shadow dodge thing actually put out fire? That's kind of strange. Alright, then we got this stuff, which, honestly... I'd go for the 10% damage. We're just a little bit shy of getting both, which stinks. But I guess that's because I took that dumb bop in one of the rooms, so we didn't get as much bonus gold. Uh, Alright, well, we'll take the damage at the very least. Won't leave empty-handed. Now we're at a base damage boost of 20%. Just on dexterity alone. Which is pretty solid after two runes? Two runes. Oh, it's a vault! We got lucky by getting a vault in one of the unknown rooms. Oh hell yeah! All right, let's let's go. Oh, excuse me, sir. Just trying to really put me down on that one, piece of shit. All right, we'll just wait that fucker out. <laughs> trying to psych me out like all the rest of those fuckers try to do. And boom, easy peasy. What do we get for our trouble? Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Parrying reflects projectiles. Plus 20% damage per active curse, which we have one. Minus 50% damage against uninjured enemies. Whew, I don't know about this, though. I don't know about this one. We might be better off just removing that curse and going on our way. Because this would remove our good synergy with our, our barbed whip doing the weakened effect and then having some of the weakened boosts that's, that we've got right now. Uh, so we'll say no to this. Get that curse removed and then see what else we got. Plus 4% base damage per 1,000 gold. Yes. And then a different dagger. 3% base damage for point of perception, which we have a little bit of. Uh, but again, I don't want to remove the whip. So, let's take that. Okay. Okay. I mean, I kind of kind of feel bad about give, getting rid of that cursed shield or whatever, but honestly didn't seem that great. So let's move on. Pretty lucky to get a vault on a mis mystery room, though. Ah, oh, it's just a healy thing. What a waste. 
What a waste. Uh, okay, 765. Yeah, attributes will be good here. Should be able to afford both of whatever these are going to be. We just get a little bit more money. Just a little bit more money. We don't need a whole lot more. Just a little bit. Starting to grasp the range of the whip a little bit better now. It's a couple times I've definitely been just slightly out of range, and then of course they've got greater range than I do, so I take a dumb bomb. Oh boy, that was a little bit spicy. Excellent, excellent. Whips and shields are both secondaries, yep. Mm-hmm. That's the only unfortunate bit about that about that choice we had to make. Ooh, two hundred percent greed kill time, I'm sure. Cause I definitely would have taken it if I could have Well, maybe I wouldn't have taken Maybe I wouldn't have given up my fire claws either if it had been a primary. I don't know. It was a tough call to make, regardless of what it was going to be. Bonk. Okay, I'll keep that rolling. Uh, can we? Oh, no, we don't have enough. We don't have anything to get in there. That kind of stinks. Ah, well. <clears throat> Whipping a shield with a percent chance to auto parry. Oh man, would you? That would be pretty sick, wouldn't it? Nah, unfortunately that build's not possible. Oh nice, 750, cheap, cheap, and it gets us the health and the treasure find. All right, well I would have preferred maybe health and damage, but we're already pretty good damage wise right now. Not bad at all, really. That would be a hell of a build though. Cursed sword, a whip, and a and a shield with auto parry. Oh, that'd be too strong. That'd be much too strong. That's probably why they don't let you do that. <laughs> they must have done a little bit of balancing, right? Oh, nice. Okay. Wasn't sure if he was gonna get into range quickly enough. Excellent, excellent. Sometimes those big dudes can be a little scary and misjudge what exactly their attack range is. But we made it through. That's the important thing. That's the important thing, right there. Oh, oh wow. Got them both. That was pretty fucking solid. Oh, excuse me, sir. Okay, definitely... Definitely helps we have that greed kill timer extend, because I would have lost it there, right? Killing a burning enemy restores 1% health. Seems like the thing to have. Plus 3 constitution. Alright, what can we get rid of for it? Uh, Honestly, probably this sucker here, because we do not have a sword. Yeah, at this point, getting rid of that one is the way to go. So, 350 max health. Got a health restoring thing going on. Plus, plus we've got the uh, double healing effects going too. So that's really 2% max health restore. Excellent. <laughs> Fucking excellent. And we're already up to the first boss too. So making good time. Making good decisions and good time. During an enemy has a chance of triggering an earthquake. What does that mean? I guess we'll find out. Actually, we won't really find out, will we? Because we're going to be killing the boss. Hmm. All right, that's fine. Okay, I 
I gotta remember I've got my... Oh! <laughs> gotta remember I've got my, uh... Whip thing to do the spin to get rid of all those, and I just totally eat shit. <laughs> totally eat shit just by staying up in his grill. So good, good job. Good job, me. Ah, well, it's fine. Oh! Ow. Okay, that at least get me some health because I think he was burning. <clears throat> Excellent. 28 health recovered there. Alright, plus we've got the extra stuff going on here, so let's see what we get. Uh, critical damage, damage, pillars, 20% base damage, is secondary is a whip. It's pretty solid, but we do lose our burning, so... And we get two free, two free constitution for getting rid of it, so, yoink. Plus 30% damage in darkness, plus three constitution. But we do have that flame weapon, so we're not likely going to be fighting in darkness. So let's take the permit to perception. 30% damage in light. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um... Honestly, considering this one, I'll just uh, ditch this one for it, I think. Uh, plus three dexterity. I don't really care for the thorn seed, so let's get two dexterity. And then plus eight to the single highest. Oh boy, so that's another eight dexterity. Uh, that in mind, I think I will replace this one. All right. Okay. Wow, I do like having the quintuple drops on bosses instead of double, so we made the right call swapping out one of those starter perks. Because that was pretty nice. Uh, Alright, so let's see what, what we got here. Ah, nuts. So if we go these two, we get cut off from that vault up there. So I guess we'll go here. Go here instead, because I do want to see what's in that vault. Assuming we clear that room without taking a hit, as is the unlock requirement for the vault. But we'll see, we'll see. Alright, wait that out, you stupid idiot. <laughs> How dare you try to fucking fool me. Bonk. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna avoid that fucker again. Like, they're gonna try to fool me on that every time. I'm gonna be like, no man, fuck you. Ooh, it's a different barbed whip. With slightly better stuff going for it, so... Yoink. So what was the other one? The other one was plus 20% if my main was a sword? Yeah. But we don't have a main as a sword, so definitely the good call. Nice. Bonk, bonk, bonk. <clears throat> there we go. Hitting our stride early in this run. Like that. Plus 2 perception, plus 15% critical damage. Eh. Two dexterity, plus fifteen percent critical damage. Oh, oh, come on. All right, 
I guess that was my for not uh, being aware of that trap there. Silly. Hey, okay, bonk. Oh, damn it. It's a trap on the other side, too. Oof. Oof. Not my best work. Ow, and there's one there, too! <laughs> Son of a bitch! Come on! Oh, man, that was really... rolling low perception that time, I guess. Oops. Oopsie doopsie. There you go. So, for throwing weapons? No. I think I got hit by all four sides of that. That's fucking embarrassing. <laughs> that is fucking embarrassing. All right, no, no big deal. We'll, we'll bring it back. We'll bring it back. We've got our health refiller thing going and, and plenty of time to do it, so no problem. Bonk, bonk. Bonk. Okay, let's get one of those out of there. I don't want to have to deal with multiple of these fuckers at once. There we go. Nice. Good adaptation. Good adaptation. Is there really nothing there? Feels like we should do something. Exciting little connector room here. Wait, that's literally all there was. Just a little bit of, little bit of stuff. Hmm. Okay. Nope. I mean that sick eight percent. All right, now we're looking better. All right, let's wait out that fucker. He's not gonna be able to get to me right away. Oh, nice. <laughs> Okay. We get for our trouble. Uh, percent damage taken in gold. Thirty percent critical damage. Five percent of critical damage also heals me. And seven dexterity. Well, what do you think our critical damage is at right now? Like maybe. 80, 90? That's four. Four or five ish on heal on a critical hit. <sighs> Dang. That's real tempting just because of the dexterity boost, too. Plus seven is nothing to sneeze at, but. Hmm. Well, maybe I replace this one out. Twenty-seven hundo though. That would cut my damage significantly, actually, because we get, what, 4% per thousand? Hmm. Yeah, okay, maybe I'll skip it. Tempting though it was, maybe we'll skip that one for now. We'll save our money for something else down the, down the road. Maybe a good weapon pickup here. 
Something to swap out our spear, maybe for some bombs. Ow, what the? I think the, the health boost on that one would have been okay, but we're really just making a whole lot back with just the uh, fire kills, 30 per or whatever, right? Oh, easy. Bonk. Excellent. So now we're already back to full health. Good. Super good, and another mace. Mm, uh, <clears throat> 5% base damage per level of relics carried? Huh. That's an interesting thing. We don't even need the health boost for sacrificing it, but whatever. I'll take it anyway. And this is going to be a weapon, so... Hmm. Look at this. Critical damage will stay on... Okay, I don't care about that one. Critical damage for three seconds after a perfect dodge. 1% base damage per point of dexterity, which is fucking sick. 28%. Uh, but not really much else, unfortunately. Like, having our primary do burning damage and then getting heals from burning kills is good. I'm really hesitant to give that up. Could lean into a poison build. really lean into a poison build. That's a pretty cheap a cheap up there too. It's not really that much less on base damage plus poison. And it would uh, it would free up one of our relic slots to get rid of that uh, kind of weakened synergy too. Fire poison. Fire poison. Alright, let's lean into fire poison. This is a uh, thump. Yeah, I do like the charge attack on it as well. Okay, so now we've got quickness. We've got very quick stuff going. I like it. Uh, okay, I wouldn't mind seeing a different two-hander weapon, but honestly, money upgrade bolt would be probably a better way to go. The better strategy. Since, oh, what, what, what do we get here? Taking damage triggers a wave of darkness. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> oh no. Again, kind of a worthless curse, but... Jeez. <laughs> Alright, just gotta remember we don't have the... Don't have the whip's range anymore. Don't have the whip's range or stun. So we're gonna have to lean on the poison damage a bit more. <laughs> Which is fine, like, fucking... Just look at that sick damage! <laughs> the quadruple attack with heavy poison. And then we can just finish off whatever we need with the fire. Whoop, sir, excuse me. Really sick. Really sick build we got going now. So he's probably gonna die from straight up poison. Well, that was silly. Not anticipate his range there. Oh well. Oh, damn, I forgot his secondary attack is so fucking dumb. Jerk. <laughs> the second swipe on that, he just pulls a fucking 180 out of nowhere and nails me with it. What a jerk. What a jerk. Alright, oh. <clears throat> we could double stack on the gold damage boost, huh? 
because I'd be okay with getting rid of... Oh no, we already got rid of the weakened uh, boost. Dang. <coughs> well, I definitely don't want to get rid of this, then. I don't know if I want to double stack over anything else. Probably not. Just give me the money for it, then. Nuts. Although, if we did get uh, a double stack of those at 6% per thousand... I would probably go for that. <laughs> that's a that's a sick 120% damage boost if we fully match both of them. That would be worth anything, really. Oh, jeez. Okay, sir. Oh. Kind of hoping this dude would help us out with a, a quick smack, but no such luck. Oh, okay, get a shield build going. Uh, parry main weapon deals critical for two seconds. See, that would have been good with our um, heals on critical hits, but uh, too little too late there. Oh well. Different spear. A barbed spear. Mmm, 1% base damage per point of dexterity. Finishers weaken enemies. Okay, so this could take on... Honestly, this wouldn't be a bad trade-up. Better base damage. Hella much better bonus damage, too, for some reason. Okay. Sure. It's a, it's a spear, so it's not my favorite, but still. Let's go upgrade. We, we need to upgrade our, our fire claws a little bit. I think that's still sitting at base level one. I'm willing to lose a bit of a damage boost to improve that. Um, what did I get hit by there? Is there a thing going on that I just totally spaced on? Whatever. Bonk. Oh, I probably stood right next to that thing. Duh. <laughs> Fucking duh. Oh, jeez, excuse me. Okay, he's got the turn around there. Look out, look out. No! Oh, shit. Oh, stop healing him. A hole. Mm. Twenty percent base damage for daggers. Do we have a dagger? I think we do have a dagger, right? That's what our secondary is considered. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Considering how much that's already doing, do we swap something out for this? Mm. Maybe this one. Even though we'd be losing 4% base damage and then the extra damage boost for being in the light. Or I could give up the greed kill time limit. Which honestly, we're moving fast enough where it's probably not as important to have that. Okay, yeah, let's do that. <sighs> oh! Nice job. <laughs> <laughs> nice job, idiot. Way to, way to play with that one. I think those do rotate to fire at you all the time. Okay. Shitbags. Alright, what do we got? I said I was going to lean into my primary improvement here, so what do we got? 20% base damage if secondary is a whip. Well, no longer have the whip. But we do get two base damage and two more bonus damage. Alternatively, we could lean into the poison... A little bit more. Plus five base damage, plus four bonus. Well, that's already at level three. three. Let's boost this one first. Nice and cheap. We'll recover that 12 hundo in no, problem, in no time at all here. <sighs> okay. 
course we've got to go for the vault. Never not go for the vault. Because it could be it could be a cursed sword, and if it's a cursed sword we got we have to take it. Like it's the law. <laughs> Let's go. Bonk. Whoop. Excuse me. Bonk. 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 Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Alright, what do we get? Ah, oh, it's just a hammer. Poop. What do we get here? Ooh, look at that. Whoa! Oh, well, under the final curse. Damn. <laughs> I saw the plus 40 there, and I'm like, oh, damn! But only while under the final course. Ah, uh, that's too bad. That's too bad. Although, plus 40 across everything is real impressive. And just straight up plus 7 decks, so... Honestly, it might be good to take this. <laughs> nah, I should just remove the curse. Alright, what do we got here, then? 15% damage against weakened enemies. Oh, our spear does weaken stuff now, doesn't it? <coughs> oh, but I don't use the spear very often. I guess we'll just take the corruption reduction. Dang. Dang. See, again, they, they dropped some stuff that might have been okay for a different sort of build, but not this time. Not this time. Oh, well. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Ah, this fucker. Okay. Oh, see, I even prepared for a second swipe, and he was late with it, you shitbag. Oh. Oh, excuse me again. Ah, oh, you. Oh, come on, that wasn't fair. Come on, fucker. Unpoison me. Shit. Ow, fuck. Okay, this dude's uh, doing way more to me than he should. Alright, fuck face, come on. Okay. Get your bips back. There. Fucker. <laughs> this is waiting. It's waiting for him to just make an approach here. Shit bag. Oh. Okay, that could have gone better. But hopefully we've got a couple of these that will- Ooh, what is this? Ah. An even slightly better primary weapon. Although, we do lose the 12% damage boost from Constitution. Let's see what else we got first. Lightning attacks I don't care about. Another lightning attack, but I don't care about. <laughs> uh, dexterity boost, pretty good, but we'll just go with that. Here. Here, this is good. 18% health boost, thank you. Good lord. Kind of at death's door there. And now we gotta make a choice here. Do I lose that 12% base damage boost? For a slightly better all around? Probably, huh? Probably. Yeah, okay. We'll make it work. We'll make it work. Alright. 
now we're kind of sitting at... Uh, okay, no more bolts on the approach, unless we get lucky on that unknown spot. Which we should probably try for. Let's go attributes first, then challenge to get money, upgrade, and then... All the way to the end. Right? Yeah, that, that two-handed, I think it was a knight's broadsword, was super good. Like, it felt great. Every every attack you land, it felt super good. So you had to, you had to work for it, but it's absolutely well-earned. Bonk. Uh, five dexterity, then go in the snow. <laughs> Not terribly good there. Oh, god damn it. I just didn't pay attention to the trap. <laughs> Your way to victory. What do we got there? Oh, it's a shield. Not a bad one either, but we'll take the money. And what's this? Upgrade? Oh no. Attributes. Uh, do I care about treasure find? Do I have anything that boosts on perception? No, huh? Unfortunate. But we'll take I mean, it's pretty cheap. May as well. Can't take it with you. <clears throat> we'll get most of our money back in this next room anyways. Probably the entirety of it, if we play it right. The entirety plus interest. Plus more money. Mm. Alright, let's go. Oh, fuckers. Oh, no. Oh, jeez. Excuse me. Oh, God. Can they throw that shit in the middle? Come on, fucker. Jerks. Of course, one of them is a fucking elite, so that's great. Jerk offs. <laughs> more health there than we needed to, but good thing we get a 12% there. It's a pretty solid chunk, and then 13 hundo or so is what it said. So well, not bad. Because we gained back quite a bit. 80 more health than we started. Good enough. Okay, so then that leads into upgrade. <clears throat> and then we'll probably roll the dice with the unknown, hope for another vault. Because that would be fucking sick. Fucking sick. All right. Very good. Let's try, it, buddy. <laughs> Bonk, bonk. Alright, just trying to keep our timers alive here. Bonk, bonk, 
Bonk. Nice. Alright. Get this fucker out of here immediately because I don't want to deal with him. Whoop! Oh! Ah, you little bitch! Why do those fucking circulate forever? Out of here with that shit. Oh, don't even. Ah. Evil. <laughs> That's all right. We still got a net positive on health, I think. <laughs> really prefer to have kept my grid gold timer though. All right, what is this? An upgrade one? Okay, sixteen hundo, regardless. Let's keep leaning. Well, lean even more into poison. Sure. Honestly, it's doing the most damage out of all the weapons I've got. Roll the dice on the unknown. Come on, vault. We got lucky once earlier. Eh? 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 Aw. <laughs> Would have been something. Would have been something. Ah, nice try, idiot. Fucks. Out of here. Oop. No, why are there three of them? Get out of here. Just get. Okay, at least these other two are just tiny fuckers. Big ass idiots. Still. So annoying. The most annoying enemy. Jerks. Alright, whatever. Pretty good room regardless. Oh, so it's a, it's a weapon. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Does much higher base damage than the spear, even. And its bonus is double. Double and a half, looks like. 1% base damage per dexterity. Okay. Shit. That's pretty good. A little late. A little late in the game for it, but it's pretty good. What else do we have? A new barbed whip? Or a, a different spear. Another different spear. Hmm. I think I gotta go with the bombs. I gotta go with the bombs. Like, the, the lightning ones aren't my favorite ones, but they seem potent enough that they'll, they'll do some work. <clears throat> Alright, so not a bad score for that unknown room. <laughs> now here comes the lightning boosts. All right, uh, plus four constitution is pretty solid too. What else can we get rid of anything good for that? Mm. Doesn't look like it. All these are pretty solid. Well, with the exception of this, maybe this one. I could probably stand to get rid of this one. <laughs> Cause I'll I'll eat the um, six percent damage loss, and I honestly don't know how often we're fighting in the light. <laughs> I haven't really noticed, so okay. Let's swap it out for a more stable damage boost at least. And here's another one of those, but this one's much better already, so let's take our health and be done with it. Go the 
this way though, because I saw all that gold. All that money. Alright, wasn't that much money. But it was something. I honestly have no idea what the shocked status effect does to enemies. I think it just discharges when you hit him next. So bonus damage, I guess, huh? Got me from behind. Good job, idiot. Good job, you got me. Good. Good, 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 good. Stop! Oh, the trap gets me. Fuck you. We'll keep up our health since we're making 36 per kill now. Really sick. Straight up dexterity boost. <clears throat> Which at this point might not be a bad idea. How far off we how far off are we from the end? Just two rooms. One room, really. So that might be a good trade up. An extra 10% damage and losing our double health or double healing rather. Yeah, I think I'll do it. Lean in. Lean in on damage. Since we're getting a 80% base boost now. Which is super rad. One more attribute buff and then we'll be ready to kick some ass. Alright, regular enemies can spawn into- yeah, whatever. <laughs> Hardly a threat. Hardly a threat. We just need to make sure not to get bodied in this final room here. And we'll be alright. <laughs> Stop healing him, fucker. <laughs> we got there, plus five constitution, yada yada yada. No, nope. I probably should have waited on that, actually. Until we were done with the room, but... Whoop. Okay. Ah, exactly. Oh well. I have a little bit off uh, max health. That's alright. Won't need that extra 18, I hope. <laughs> Except we're not done here yet, are we? Oop. Keep on your toes. Can't fall asleep just yet. Whoop. Oh, 
Oh, okay, I rolled through that, I thought. Shit. That's alright, we can be down 100 health, that's fine. No problem. <laughs> hmm, okay, that would just be... Frugal and beneficial to only take the health boost. That won't reduce my base damage any. Plus, it'll make it like I didn't lose any health at all. And maybe even have a little bit more. Okay. Let's roll. I think we got a, a real good shot at this. Good, good, pretty, pretty all around build. Not anything super spectacular. Good base stats. <clears throat> Which one are we fighting? Oh, snake arm. Okay, very good. Oh, right. I forgot he did this stupid one. Oh, sir. Alright, should die soon. Oh, and then the little tiny ass bat interrupts me. Get out of here, fuckface. Ah. Get some idiots. Uh oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> Stupid tanky blanders. <laughs> nice. Excellent use of a classic Simpsons quote. Ouch. Uh, oh, 360. Ooh, that's a big hit. Not like it matters, he's dead. Bonk! <laughs> Alright, pretty good fight. We took a, a couple really big dumb bops in there, but 848 to spare, no problem. Get all of our cool shit, and we're out of here. Excellent. Excellent, 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 excellent. So, how much do we have then? Probably not enough for anything super cool. 256? Pretty solid gains, because I think we had 90? We gained 160 some there. But we still need, what, a thousand? A thousand. Or three hundo to, to get that rolling, right? A thousand's gonna be a tall order. Definitely not by tonight. Ooh, I see a cursed weapon there. What is that? It's like a hammer? A mace. Base damage increases by your percentage of missing HP. Interesting. Why didn't it take us to that new final boss? Oh, because it was one of the challenge event things, not the uh, not the mainline level thing. I usually like to warm, warm up with one of those. 
But now we'll do the main line and, and see what we can see here. Yeah, this cursed mace doesn't seem very good. Each attack consumes five gold, which on a primary weapon is not great. Poison whip, though, and crackling grenades are one of my favorites. Normal ass sword, normal ass dagger, and a s poison spear. Oh, 20% poison sword. Not super good either. Or fire claws again, and a barb whip. And the titan slayer is tempting. Because it's a big old, big old beast there. But mm, none of these weapon sets are super good. Honestly, I'd probably take this one. Though I do like the crackling grenades. The poison whip isn't bad either, and we can always ditch the the cursed mace if we want to. So, all right, let's let's try that. Let's try it. Uh, let's give it a go. We'll probably ditch it at a pretty early opportunity because it's not super great, but let's see what we can do. <laughs> See what we can do here. Mm -hmm. Alright, what are we dealing with? <clears throat> Any vaults on the way? One. <clears throat> Two. Two vaults on our way through. Let's start with some money. Money, attributes, relic, etc. <laughs> Oh, oh, jeez, it's a slow one, too. That's kind of silly. The fact that it's using 5 gold for attack is probably the killer on it. Because we're not going to be making a whole lot of early money. So we might have to focus around the whip. Focus around the whip as much as we can so we preserve our monies. But I guess it's working out so far. Oh, do we have we do. That's right. Oh, I forgot I had the grenades. Dirt. <laughs> Got one of my favorite weapons. Alright. Not a terribly exciting relic, but something that we'll take along with us for now. And a gold offerings amount? Sure, for now. Sure, for now. Okay. Okay. If we keep that greed kill count up, we'll definitely make more money than we'll spend on using this weapon. Okay, wasn't sure how the timing of that was going to work, but we made it happen. It's a little bit under a thou, going through that room. Oh, yeah, actually even more. Right, because we didn't even get the thing. Nice. Uh, Normal-ass fire bow instead of grenades? Heck no. Get out of here with that. What are you trying to pull? Mm-hmm. A little spooked there. It's all right. Oh, what? Oh, he did not telegraph that as much as I thought he was gonna. 
You shit. Very quick on the draw. Good for him. Good for him. Like that was a, a winning strategy for the brief two seconds he stayed alive. Did us increase our damage. Is that true? Oh, is that the thing on the mace too? Oh yeah, it is. So it does. So we should really be running this Iron Man, shouldn't we? Hmm. Well, maybe not. That'd be a bit too dangerous. Joke's on you, fucker. Every time you hit me, I get stronger. <laughs> That's really what it is, isn't it? Okay, shield. Nah. Another thorn seed. I don't really care for that either. Kind of stupid, just basic drops we're getting. Do not like it. All right, there we go. Health and damage. Health and damage is exactly what we're looking for. Pretty cheap, too. Up perception, the, the lowest level of perception boost we can get. Great, thanks. Oop. Please die. Thank you. <laughs> oh, don't hit that. Oh. Oh! Oh, okay. You're gonna hit that too, ain't you? Of course you are. Oh, I wasn't even close to you, you fucker. Oh man, that takes money even if I don't connect with it. That kind of stinks. Whoa! Careful, buddy. <laughs> Careful, buddy. Alright, what is this just a- oh, here we go. Killing a burning enemy restores 1% health. Like, stamina increase, not bad. And, ugh. Like, we don't have anything that causes burning, do we? So this is kind of worthless. Oh well, that's fine. That's fine. We'll, we'll take just the monies. The money increases is fine by me. Uh... Um, I guess the long play here would be probably go for that tiny boss there to get rid of the curse we're about to get. Yeah, then we can stock up on health after the first section boss if we really need to. So I'm hoping we don't. Alright, what do we got? Maximum st Ah, see that sucks. Maximum stamina reduced by one. This one's kind of bad. Then I mean, if any weapon restores two instead of one. Okay, that's better, but having one less bip in total really stinks. We never, never not want to have bips. Excuse me, sir. Priming piece of shit. Oh, fuck you. Able. <laughs> hmm. 
I guess I shouldn't have asked for it. Like that was that's on me. I did tell them to try me, and they did. And they did a good job. So good good for them. Good for them. Uh okay, so now we can consider Uh I'm not really a big fan of the weighted blades either. But 20% base damage is secondary is a whip, which we do have. And it doesn't cost us money to use. So Hmm. Yeah, okay. Lower base damage, lower bonus damage. We are offsetting the loss of 20% damage per curse by just getting straight up 20% damage per having a whip. Plus it's a better weapon. I think it's a better weapon in general. A little bit faster, maybe? And less silly. Yeah. Okay, we gave the cursed mace a go. I wasn't a fan, so... Rip. Rip, Cursed Mace. Wasn't great. Didn't make the cut. See, that already feels better. <laughs> I'm not super worried about my money usage anymore. a bunch of curses and a high constitution build at low HP, right? Yeah. Like, it does feel like a very... a very specialty build type of thing. Which, you know, I can appreciate... Ooh, that was close. I can appreciate definitely, but... Maybe not on a full-ass run through here. Uh, daggers. Do we have something considered a dagger? No. It's a throwing. Okay, what can we get for it otherwise? Minus four corruption. Uh, well, it would keep us from getting a second curse at the at the room break here. Let's do that. Old offerings remove five corruption. I guess. How many relics we got, anyways? All right, we got a couple more slots. That'll be an easy one to give up when we need to upgrade stuff. All right, so it really would behoove us to fight this boss, remove this curse, and then the next boss fight will remove the curse we're going to get soon. Let's do it that way. <clears throat> really got to kind of manage our corruption a bit more in these full run-throughs since we get 30 and not 20 per room. All right. Oh, it's teleport punch, dude. I don't like this. <laughs> do not like this fucker. Especially when he does that. Excuse me, sir. Out of bips! <laughs> Gotta not be out of bips! Whoop! Ooh. 
good work on that one. Nice. Okay. So we took like two or three hits in there. Not bad. Really was just here for the curse lift. So we're gonna get one back anyways. As soon as we leave this room. 50% damage to poison. Do we have poison? We do. Our whip. Yoink. And a different... And a pistola. 20% chance for poison. 20% base damage to main weapon is a sword. It is not... And it's really not that great, so... No, nope, take the free one perception out of it. What do we head into? A different weapon. Okay. Yeah, I could stand to get another different primary weapon. <laughs> like, the whip's good, the, the bombs are good, the throwing knives... Uh, the passive increases corruption... Uh, yuck. Alright, not ideal, but whatever. We will get less corruption passively here than we would from the room transition. Three at a crack though instead of two. Ugh. Just a little bit below a thousand for the boss, which is not super good, but we'll make it work. Hopefully with a better weapon. Ah. Well, it's still weighted blades, but it's maybe better. Not really, though. Lower bonus damage. Poison, or not poison, lightning. We lose the base damage boost from having a whip. Does have plus 20 on critical. It's still really shitty. Hmm. Well, we'll limp along with our current primaries for now. What's this one? It's Electro Wizard? No. No, this one. Okay. Oh. 
Oh, oh come on. Oh. Oh, come on. Shit bang. Oh. Um. Okay, uh, it's not the greatest fight we've ever had, but we survived. Uh, uh, you know what? Let's get rid of let's get rid of whatever new one's incoming. Better the curse we know than the curse we don't know, right? Okay. Spear? No thanks. Plots. Claws, claws, claws. Normal ass claws. With a 30% boost against bosses. And elite enemies, so not bad. We'll think about that one. It's plus 3 dexterity, or just permanent plus 2 dexterity. Doink. Uh, passing through a door inflicts 50% less corruption. Hmm. Or plus 3 dexterity. And then. A stronger whip. Well, a differently stronger whip. Oh, do we really have, like, a cross thing going on here? 20% base damage is main weapon is throwing. 20% base damage secondary is a whip. Damn it, these really work well together, don't they? Oh, man, I should probably just keep them then. That's silly. Alright, give me the money. And... Give me the money. <laughs> oh, that's kind of unfortunate. I guess we'll learn to like him. We'll learn to like him. Um, I really could probably use a health thing, couldn't I? Yeah. Yeah, we'll get a health thing. Be safe, we're only past the first third of it. And the vault, the vault that's coming up too, so... Here's hoping. If we get a curse sword there, oh, that would be fucking toasty, wouldn't it? Be real good. All right, one, two. We'll take a third because we don't have any health refills yet. No health refilling things on kills or what have yous. Hopefully, we'll pick one up soon. So we got what? We got one more empty slot, and then we can start picking and choosing out of our shittier one. Sir. Uh, oh, I swear. Swear I fucking moved out of the way of that thing, but apparently I didn't. I'm the idiot. Stop healing him, you fuck. Grenades. Oh, oh, I missed his windup. Little piece of shit. Upgrade? 
upgrades. Upgrades would be good. Haha, here we go. Here's our health restorer. A solid base damage boost to it, too. Okay, a little bit of sustainability. Excellent. A little bit of sustainability. Alright, what do we get here? Lose as much gold as you take damage. Yeah, fuck. Health loss reduced by 25%. Alright. Alright, I'll make something work. Oh, crap, and I was out of bips, too. You shit. Barbed whip. job just standing there and taking that one. Oh, poison yourself to death. Thank you. I wanted the help. <laughs> Six percent of gold offerings amount, or two and plus two dexterity. Honestly, I guess I'll take it because we have one of these already. But I'll take it for the dexterity boost, and then we can ditch the other one. Oop! Excuse me, sir. was out of bips. I'm like, oh no! Oh wait, did I ever determine if I was out of bips if I could then parry? I can. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Duh. Duh. Use the other side of my controller once or twice, huh? Okay. Attributes then bolt. If your reflexes are good enough, and if you remember that you have such an ability, right? Oh, excuse me, sir. Fifteen percent against weakened and two perception. Honestly, I could probably just use the perception off of that. Uh, take that instead of this one. I will take both health and treasure. Fine. Okay. I don't think. All right. Now on to the vault. <laughs> don't fuck this up now. 
I want whatever's in there, probably. Wouldn't mind a replacement anything. Stop healing! Little fucker, stop it. <laughs> oh, well, okay. I rolled into that on my own, so that's my problem, I guess. <sighs> Damn, it. <laughs> Damn it, now we're looking at three curses. Okay, we got one more vault coming up, but we're really gonna have to probably focus down those other bosses because, um, mm, not looking great. Not looking great with the three curses. Door imposing a payment, blah 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 blah. Okay, yeah, whatever. We can deal with that one. That one's pretty fucking tame. Three hundo. Three hundo at a crack. Stop fucking healing! Why are these fuckers always around here? Get out! Just fucking get! Oh, alright, good. Okay, cool. <sighs> Annoying. <laughs> Irritating pieces of shit. Only I may heal. Again, stop fucking healing. Stop it. Stop that shit. Uh, 50% against weakened, 8% max health. Okay. <sighs> Gold offerings removed to corruption, you need yana. Okay, I might. Pair this up with this one here. Boy, howdy, we are looking re in real bad shape. We're probably going to end up with maybe even a fourth curse after this first segment. That's not super good. <laughs> not super good. Means we're dicking around too much, really. the wind-up on that, people. Oh, fuck you! Oh my god. Bombs? Hmm. Yeah, 
Yeah, I guess I'll take it. It's slightly better than those, I guess. Damage-wise, but... Mm. Yeah, going into this boss fight with four of them. It's not super great. <laughs> oh... This kinda stinks. This kinda stinks. So we hit that final curse probably midway through, not even midway, probably like a third of the way through this next segment. Hmm. God damn it, did that really take off one of my relics? It did! Which one? Uh, oh, that one. Okay. God damn it. Of course. Shit. Uh, well, I guess I'll take this one instead then. <laughs> no problem. Uh, oh, Inspire, dude. Do not like. Um, excuse me, what was that 180 turnaround? Go fuck yourself. Oh. Oh, that's a big explode, sir. What is that? Um, okay. Excuse me. Yeah, good. Just pull me right into him. Good. Good job. Good job. Good thinking. <sighs> Where's the fucking delayed double that fuck you fucking gets me? Okay, thank you. Oh! Okay, I'm swear I'm hitting the damn fucking parry button. Oh my god. 
<laughs> okay. Well, <laughs> that probably will seal it right there. <sighs> Honestly, the dark fervor is what's killing me here. So that really gives me way more corruption than I can really handle. It sucks. It really sucks. <laughs> Alright. Barbed whip. 1% uh, max health. 20% base damage if Wayne opens a claw, but it's not. 30% damage against bosses. Honestly, I should take this one. The base damage is so much better. A much better, just normal ass perception boost. Look here for the hammer. Ooh. Okay. It's five. Okay. Ah, nuts. I can't. Well, I could take it. Uh, do I have anything poison? I don't anymore by getting rid of that other whip. Okay, so then I can take this instead of this. I don't know if we have lightning, but at least it gives me dexterity. Yikes, this is going to be a very, a very touchy situation here. I really can't afford to get any more just normal-ass corruption, which healing would give me, so... I have to just pretty much go straight line, straight up here, and hope we get some, like, really good kills or something? Oh, right, we do get the 10% heals through each door for paying gold. Okay, that'll help. That's good longevity. Alright, that's okay. That's that's a less problematic curse to have than the one we just got rid of. So we'll deal. try to do whip kills to get oh my god get some extra health oh come on oh my god Oh, come on, they still managed to tag me, huh? Yourselves. <laughs> Alright, here, this is good. Nice 180 boost there. Shit. Okay. Adjust my strategy a little bit. That's okay. That's okay. We can do this. We're nothing if not capable of learning. Like so. as much as the next person. Whew. 
Stop healing! Stop it! Oh my god, and there's one of those fuckers too, huh? Oh, he was the dude that was healing before, wasn't he? Oh, of course. Pins me up against that thing. Thanks, fuckface. We appreciate it. Eat shit. Got hardly any money. Oh, right, because any damage I take, I lose money, right? That's one of the things? Which one is it? This, no. Wait, wait, wait. I thought, right? Here. No? Here. Lose as much gold as you take damage. Fuckers. I don't have any fucking money. Ugh. Well, at least I've got enough money for the door. Not looking great. <laughs> Not looking great, but if we can nail this vault room, we might still be in it. Here we go. Oh! Run out of bips. Stop fucking boosting them! You shit in us? God, got one of the dudes with the fucking. Yeah, he shit. Dude with a goddamn AoE spear, too, so that's fucking cool. Okay, that was one. <laughs> there. We needed that. Oh, what do we got? Ooh. Okay. Ooh, that's strong. That would drop drop my uh, healing weapon, though. What else we got? Okay, back to a poison whip. Would drop my healing as well. But give me four constitution, so you give me that. Oh, tempting. Extremely tempting here. Because I do like the chromatic knives a lot. A lot, a lot. But 16% max health would be even better. Oh, but I can remove a curse with this one. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Um, I would honestly prefer to have my last relic slot back. But we're coming up on a boss fight too, so I can drop it with that one. Let's get rid of, um, let's get rid of this one. Because losing, losing gold from getting hit is really shitty. Turns out it's not great. Turns out it's not the best thing to have. Okay, got a boss coming up. A thousand to work, a thousand health to work with. Pretty decent weapons now. Yeah, I think we're going to have to take both these upcoming bosses. Get rid of two curses. And we'll probably have another second or third by the time we get to the last one anyways, so... Okay. Okay, we just need to we just need to play well. That's all we need to do. Oh, it's this one. Okay. That's true. We did have a slight defense, I guess. Oh, that was oh very scary play. Oh, come on! Caught me looking on that. Ah, oh, shit. Oop, easy. Oh, 
Mm. Moves. All right, easy peasy. Bonk. All right. Took a couple dumb hits. Ended up gaining another fucking curse in there, so... Uh, let's get rid of this one and hope for a slightly less problematic one coming up. Oh, okay. Another poison da poison boost thing? Sure. Plus five dexterity. Okay. I think overall that was better. Overall we made some bank on it. Um, let's go straight up the middle here. Ah, <laughs> this is such a bad time to get this one! Near the end. We do get permanent haste though, so that's fun. Permanent haste is cool, but I don't know that we're gonna get 30 enemies. Uh, well, I guess we'll see. Such a bad time to have this one, though. Oh my god, what kind of fucking setup was that? Eat my ass. You shitbag. Excuse me. There we go. Oh, come on! He still managed to get through that? Eat me! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, why are there so many? Oh, it's not great. Oh, good. Yep, yeah, okay. Pin me in the corner, why don't you? No, oh my god. His fucking attack is stupid! <laughs> Stop it! You a-hole? <laughs> Jeez. These fucking dudes with the spears or whatever the fuck they have that gives them 100% room coverage is so dumb. Got no money for any of this, of course. Ugh. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Just barely keeping pace with stuff. Oh, good. This dude. Can't wait. Oh my god, really? Oh, can't be missing those. Oh! <laughs> I think I had enough bits for that. Oh, no, why though? What kind of spin was that? Oh, shit. Are you kidding me? Please. There. I'm like fucking getting buried. Shit. Oh. Oh. I fucking parried that. I parried it. I was mashing the goddamn trigger. <laughs> you fucker. Jackass. Smash the fucking trigger. Tell me I didn't do it. <sighs> Damn it. Alright, well, whatever. 300 thingamadings. Put that in there. Oh, we got 50 jade rings, too. 50 jade rings. Uh, what can we do with that? We can unlock some more weapons. These are El Cheapos. Alright, that's that one, even though I don't like spears. 
<laughs> the parry button is the left trigger. And I was mashing it like there was no tomorrow. I just didn't want to do it. It's not my fault. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, a cursed, a cursed sword. A different cursed sword. Not the fun cursed sword, but a different one. We got ten more. So let's get that one too. <sighs> okay. All right. Well, we're just gonna do probably one of the cursed archer events to finish out the night. So it doesn't matter which. Uh, doesn't matter which weapon set we take. <clears throat> I said as the strike landed. Damn it! <laughs> of course, time does uh, the tie does not go to the runner. Cause fuck me, I guess. <laughs> uh, oh well, it's fine. It's fine. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. How do you like that? Wait, why am I getting... Why did I get 20 health back on that? Is there something to the bow? Oh, shit! 2% max health for each enemy killed. Hell yeah. Okay. I'll make that work. I can make that work. Plus, do we have permanent haste or something, too, I think? They charge shots, blah, 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 blah. No. Mm. Alright, well. At least they started me off with a pretty decent one this time. <laughs> Oh, jeez, excuse me. 50% uh, damage taking gold, whatever. Oh, we're not using bips uh, on dodges either. No bip usage on dodges, alright. I think this is one of the little event ones that was. Probably one of the easier ones to do, wasn't it? I feel like we stormed through a whole bunch. So these seem pretty easy to knock, knock out here. Yeah, 390. Uh, hmm. The max health. It'll be a little bit safe on this one. <clears throat> Take the max health. I'm glad we were able to get at least enough money to legit get one. And if we really wanted a lot of money, we'd take that left hand path to the vault. We'll think about it. We'll think about it. We've got one room to think about it. Jeez. Oh, come on! What kind of distance is that, you fuck shit? Jerk ass. Uh, 80% of max health? Yeah, sure, okay. Environment kills are usually pretty stodgy. 4% of max health and you pass through a door? Jeez. Alright. It's a big ol' health build so far. 15% damage to lightning attacks. We have lightning attacks. 
Mm. I play both games about the same. How do you feel about Hades versus Curse of the Dead Gods? Huh. I think they have they have definitely have different takes on the whole roguelite thing. I enjoy them both a lot. But if I ever had to choose between the two of them, I'd probably still go Hades. I'd probably still go Hades. But this one's a lot of fun still too. I think I enjoy the combat in Curse of the Dead Gods a little bit more. It's a bit more tactical, whereas Hades always felt to me a bit more button mashy, <laughs> if that makes any sense. But I do enjoy the aesthetic and the narrative and the overall presentation of Hades a bit more. Uh, three constitution, sure, that's an easy sell. Fucking super giant games, man. They are masters in in presentation, surely. Got a lot of experience with it, and they've done some real good masterpieces. So it is a very extremely high bar to clear to beat them on that, but I don't know. I enjoy I enjoy both games very much. Like I would never not recommend either. Sir? Ouch! Okay, I rolled into it. That's my fault. Is there another thing going on? I suppose technically the charged bow shot is considered explosive, right? Knock open secrety secret walls. Sent base damage for spears. Pfft. Get out of here with that. Weakened enemies. Okay. Oops. I think I mindlessly took the left hand path. Oh well. <laughs> I wasn't even thinking about it. I was like, oh, gold! No. Get out of here with your fucking room covering slashes. Stop! Ouch it! Bastard, knock it off! Fuck face. Oh, you've gotta be kidding. Me. Shit bag. Ugh. Annoying. Blah blah blah, urns no longer contain blood, blah 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 blah. Whatever. That one's kind of stupid. Hardly worth even reading about. Sent to poison. Nope. Got no poison. Actually, does it, is this even considered an elemental thing? Dark? A dark blast, I guess? Meh. That matches up to poison or 
shock or fire. Close to a double KO as we'll get. Uh, okay. Oh, this one I can probably ditch easily. Because we don't have lightning attacks. Well, shit, what's even going to be in the vault for us that would be good? Good relics, maybe? Because we can't swap out weapons. Let me just go for it. Maybe we'll see something cool. Stop fucking healing! <laughs> Relics. Uh, okay, that's good for the dexterity boost at least. Perception is kind of meh. Oh, ah. So it's one of these, but. Or I could remove a curse. I'll remove the curse. Uh, and this one I could really care less about. Probably this one, because nothing's going to be killed by the environment, really. And then this one doesn't matter. Perception boost isn't... Well, we'll do that for the perception boost. And what was the other thing to it, though? Oh, burning enemies, right. No, we don't have anything that burns them. <clears throat> yeah, the final curse is not great. Um... We've had it a couple times, but I think the gist of it is that as long as we have it, we lose health steadily, like over time, just straight up. So it's it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad to get. But yeah, the plus 40 to everything is just, hmm, that's real tasty, but I don't think I would intentionally go for it. There might have been something else to it besides the general health drain. <laughs> I don't remember. Ah, uh, it's the Electro Wizard. All right, very good then. Well, okay, I'm pretty sure I dodged around there. Fuck you. Go, shit bang. There you go. Okay, excuse me. I guess I can set him on fire with my torch and derp. Okay, excuse me. Hole. Eat shit. For constitution, or just gain straight up dexterity. Yoink. 
Another plus four constitution. We'll gain two divine... Oh, divine favors are kind of lame. Place that one. Wow. Plus four dexterity, nine percent of max health. And I, wow, that's pretty good. Uh, swap out for that one just in case. Plus three constitution, blah, blah, blah. Two dexterity, plus three perception, and blah, blah, blah. It's corruption. Okay. Okay, not the best set to have dropped there, so very minor ups, but I'll take it. Now back to baseline corruption. We don't really need health, so if we just kind of ride this one over here, one more chance to revolt up there. Or very possibly a lucky draw in some of the unknown rooms. Twould be something. Twould be something. Sick, that counts as an environment kill. 130 a pop. How much was that? 9%. Damn. Damn, son. That? Hmm. Okay, that does some work. That's some real work there. Now we're back to full, so good thing we didn't go for one of the heal rooms. Would have been a waste. Would have been a big old fucking waste. Ouch. All right. One of you fuckers want to step over here, please? <laughs> Come on. I know you want it. There you go. Right there. Eh? Eh? Oh, no! He destroyed it before I could do the thing! You... Shithead! Oh, you're so dumb. Ah. Uh... Damn it. Oh, we got one of these. So, yoink. Slight boost there. Ah, oh, well. We'll get our health back just by normal-ass kills since we get, what, 2% from this, right? Yeah. Should not have stepped into the center. Stuck to the outside so they couldn't catch me in the crossfire. You'll get caught up in the crossfire. Alright, what do we got here? Plus two constitution, yada yada yada. Nope. Take the health. See you fucking running like you got somewhere to be over to me. Fuck you. Stop. <laughs> Ow, what? what kind of fucking attack is that, you shithead? Oh, 
Oh, you jackass. Perception, nope. Wait, don't I have a thing that gives me health for killing a burning enemy? Oh, just 1%. Hardly worth it. Not when environment kills do 9%. This motherfucker over here. Get out of here. Okay, alright, cool, good job, good job, you got me. Alright, roll the dice on the unknowns, maybe we'll get something cool. We have one? Okay, we do have 2% per thousand. Okay, we really need a better one of those. Like, even them beefy ass 6% ones, like, mmm. Mmm. Get some, idiot! I don't know what happened there, but get some! <laughs> uh, that's a weaker form of that one. Big electrical explosion. I don't think it was one of those electro mines. Something else. Me. Don't you dare. Whoa, 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 nice. Okay. Nice, okay. A bit of adaptation there. Attributes that should put us probably up to 10k, I would guess. Could spend some of it. Alright. Oh no, it's the gold loss one. Fuck. Gotta get rid of that. It's kind of threatening, actually, when you want to buy shit. Oh well. I have a lot of health. We're not been, we haven't been getting hit all that often, so we should be alright. Alright. Oh, easy. Um, okay, excuse me? Sir, stop just jumping out in front of each other. Okay, fucking aim at the dude I'm telling you to aim at. Shithead. Hmm. Whatever. Yeah, okay, we're up above 10,000, that's enough. Huh. <sighs> okay. Oh, we can probably ditch the one that gives us health between rooms, too, because we really don't need that one. Oh, it's another challenge room. Okay. More money, please. Oh, shitbag. Ooh. 
Oh yeah, get some. Get some fucking idiots. You like it, don't you? This cool 16 hundo there. Let's see if that actually pans out as 16 hundo though. I swear we've been picking up more than that. Yeah, that is slightly more. That was almost two grand. Two grand. That's right. That was a big, zzz. really big. <coughs> but okay, like I, I can deal with getting a surprise challenge room for more money. It's like that's great. Extremely helpful. Because then when we spend it here, we might still be above 10k. Excuse me. Ah, fuck. <laughs> you fucking idiot. How does it feel to be stupid? Jackasses. All right. Uh, what can? What was the one that I said I could ditch? The in between rooms room. All right. Hmm. That's only giving me two perception. Whatever. on the draw there, buddy. Bonk. Max health way more important there. This is the final third. After this fucker, whoever it is. Uh, teleport punch, dude? Yep. <sighs> Not my most favorite of dudes, to be honest. Especially when they hit me outside their hitbox. That's super cool. Um, okay, excuse me? I wonder if I can parry that. <laughs> Not like that, though. Okay, excuse me? Um, fuck you. Alright. Actually, I will get rid of this one instead, because I want my money. Fuck you. Let's deal with whatever new one they decide to give us. Ooh. Each greed killer moves to corruption. Fucking sick. Okay. Plus six constitution. Uh. Actually, what are my other choices here first? Uh, 
Oh, but then we were gaining 100% of our damage in gold, so it's probably still being offset. <laughs> nice. Well, then we'll take the three permanent constitution there. Damn, nine perception. We don't really have anything to get rid of, so take the 12% health. Take the three dexterity. Uh, take a four dexterity, and then probably just replace this one with six constitution. There we go. Okay, nice and healthy. Extremely healthy now. Alright, what do we got? Blah, 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 blah. Regular healing effects are disabled, except those coming from blood. Feeding enemies now releases blood instead of gold. Damn it. I will actually want my gold, though. <laughs> Alright, fine, whatever. Healthy build. Extremely healthy build. Now we can pretty much ditch all of our normal ass health boost ones, come to think of it. Ow, motherfucker! Ah! We're just gonna get back so much health on each kill. Five dexterity. Fifteen to damage attacks. Well, I'd probably take it over this. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Couldn't quite get that second fucker. That's all right. Would have been a nice healthy boost too. Oh, nine constitution. Uh, but I do want to keep that uh, greed kill removing corruption thing. Considering, wouldn't mind getting rid of probably this one instead. Look at that. Thirty-two constitution. Twenty-six hundred total health. I wonder what our best has ever been. Probably somewhere north of 3,000, right? Close enough for that, but whatever. Well, either way, we're gonna make back enough health that it's not really gonna matter. And damage, treasure find. Well, treasure find is gonna be less than important now because we're not gonna ever find treasure with this curse on us, so. Damage then. Straight up damage. Just the straightest up of damage. Hmm, okay. I don't know, what would what does the gold thing just do for us? I guess we'll find out. I didn't think we were really getting any money whatsoever. Although what the heck does that thing say for us? All regular healing effects are disabled. Defeating enemies now releases blood. Okay, so we can probably still pick up blood, or er, not blood, gold from chests and just on the floor. Probably, right? That's how I read that. Anyway. Yeah, okay, good. Orbital they tried to pull on me there.
Oh, whatever. I got out of that. Shitbag. Stop. What kind of... Okay, here. Eat a few fucking traps. <laughs> Give me the strong 9% boost here. He wasn't close enough for me. Shit, yes. Alright, here. You want some? Come get some. Come get some, idiot. I dare you. Ah, oh, you coward. Jerk ass. <laughs> Straight up nine dexterity. Uh... to get rid of. Oh well. I think that would have benefited us anyways. <sighs> blah 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 blah. Aw. I don't really like this one either. The extra iframes are fine, but the rest of it's kind of shitty. No, 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 no. You're trying to just get close to me, fucker, but. Alright, this is the last fucker. There. Good room. Good heals, good stuff. Jeez, oh, another one of these. Ah, <laughs> uh, man. Almost worth it for the nine dexterity alone. But I'd really just rather get rid of a curse, straight up. Uh, let's get rid of our dumb dodge one. Uh, plus seven perception. Hold. Plus seven dexterity. Goodness. <clears throat> well, heck, I might prefer it over this one, because we're not having any burning enemies, really. That one we already had. Okay. Strong build. Strong, uh, health strength build going on here. Or, constitution, dexterity, uh, health, power. Health damage. There we go. about healing, fuckers. <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> Straight up nine dexterity again. Thick 312. Come <laughs> on. 
<laughs> I just got rid of one of these. <clears throat> Nothing I really want to ditch, honestly. Take the corruption reduction, just for now. Although we're close enough to the end where it's not going to matter, really. Oh, what kind of swing is that? Oh, you fuckwit. <laughs> Little bitch. <laughs> Alright, what do we got here? Ooh, health and damage. Our big favorite. Be a little bit below the 10k limit, though. Damn, like 16. Shithead. They're not like a little tiny pot sitting around we can bust open to get that chump change. Check the couch, maybe. Hmm. Oh, right, well, whatever. We'll make it in the next room. It's fine. You know what? No. Let's unknown this to the end. Roll them dice. Roll dem dice. <clears throat> Ah. More money regardless. <sighs> Healing him again. Great, thanks, fuckface. <sighs> nope. Fucking Jesus. Stop! Oh my god. This fucking mix of enemies is the fucking stupidest I've seen in a while. Alright, this fucker needs to die. Now. Stop. Healing. Everybody. Stop it! <laughs> Sheds. Jeez. <sighs> right? Although it's been a damn long time since I've found change in my couch cushions, because I never carry change anymore. Like, the, the whole idea of carrying metal money seems just so last century. <laughs> uh. Oh, got a Heliobops thing. Alright, well we might as well take one of them, right? It's the worst I could- 570, damn. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we got fucking paper money and credit cards. Like, why would you need metal money? <laughs> it's all heavy and noisy and shit. Uh, this is this fucker. Well, this is less a challenging battle than a tedious battle, considering every charge shot stuns. And they really don't do- oops, excuse me, sir. They really don't do all that much damage either, which is kind of silly. Hits, buddy. Good, good job. You're trying. All 
Ow. Okay. Oh. Ow. Salvo. Bonk. <laughs> Alright, yeah, those Dark Archer event runs are pretty straightforward. Nothing much. Nothing much to worry about. Just get our shit and go. Get our shit and go. Very good. And look, and we still had 22 hundo health. <laughs> so we could have had our, our basic bitch 1,000 health and still survive that. It's just kind of an easy thing. Oh well. It's good to have a nice, like, easy win at the end of the night. It makes me feel good. Um, how much shit do we have? Do we have enough for anything cool? Maybe enough jade rings for another weapon or something? Yeah. What are these? Oh! Nice. Okay. Honestly, the throwing knives were starting to grow on me a little bit. I did like them. Oh, and those pierce through, too. Oh, that's super good. Okay. I'll look forward to seeing those next time. Um, and what do we need? We need 500 or 1,000. Phew. That's something. That's something. But we'll have to leave this for next time. I guess we'll give this one more week. Next week we're going to hope to uh, actually beat the final area. We'll focus it down, get shit done here. Um, but that'll do it for tonight. That'll do it for tonight. Uh, let's see, quit. Woo! Okay. Next stream will be tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. CDT, Shmup Book Club. We've got a new monthly for the month of May, and then a new partial quarterly. Uh, both are coming up for tomorrow. Don't know what those will be yet. I don't think the polls are closed. So, we'll find out. We'll find out soon, tomorrow. But then, Friday night, we're off! Saturday! Saturday? I, actually, I'm not so sure about Saturday. It's been... I maybe feel like we'll take Saturday off. We'll see. If we don't, it'll be grab bag. It'll be just something random off the stack and, uh, and play something fun or whatever. But then, Sunday night, 7pm CDT, will be long play! Spelunky 2. Or <laughs> Spelunky 2. Oh, uh, it's super fun. I'm super bad at it, but it is super fun. And then next week, Monday, 7 p.m. CDT, back here with Curse of the Dead Gods. But that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.